Hello everyone, this is Teacher Karen at nandito na naman ako para magturo sa inyo ng panibagong lesson. So, ang lesson natin ngayon ay all about polygon. Types of polygon. But before that, explain muna natin kung ano ang polygon. Polygon, in the ancient Greek language, the word polygon meant many angles. Today, however, it is more common to think of the word as meaning many sides. Polygon, it is a plain figure that is formed by three or more segments called sides of the polygon. And the end point, and each end point where the sides meet, is called the vertex of the polygon. Okay. Polygon or not? Polygon or not? This is, these are polygon. Kung mapapansin ninyo, closed figures sila. Closed figures. Yan ang polygon. And then, puro straight lines ang ginagamit as their sides. Yan, puro straight lines. Wala kayong makikita ang curve dyan kasi per vertex ay kinoconnect. Yan, nagkoconnect yung mga sides. So that will be the polygon. And these are the not polygon. Okay, yung mga circles, yung katsong mo yung mga curve, present, yan ay not polygon. Ito pa, yung mga open at yung kayong mga double yung figure kasi pinagdugtong at kasi may mga carb na halong carb at halong may straight line kasi ang mga polygons puro straight lines yung ginagamit ngayon kapag may carb katulad ng circle hearts and present at saka itong mga ito na hindi naging close figure hindi, katulad nito uh, oo side siya straight side pero hindi sila close figure dapat close figure katulad nito so this this are not polygon and this is also not polygon yung mga 3D yan these are not also polygon okay so identify each of the following pictures if it is polygon or not here this is not polygon thunder this is not also, uh, this is polygon. They, uh, it use uh, mga straight lines. So, polygon po yan. Rectangle is also polygon. Drop, not polygon. Circle, not polygon. Square or rhombus or diamond shape, that is polygon. This is straight lines po yan. And then close figure. This one, straight line siya, pero hindi siya close figure. So this is not polygon. And this is octagon. This is polygon. This is also an octagon. So this is polygon. Next, heart shape. This is not polygon. Okay, we will discuss now the types of polygon. Types of polygon according to their size. This one is a triangle. A triangle has three sides and three angles. Okay. The next one is quadrilateral. Quadrilateral uh, has four sides. We have different sides of. Uh, we have different kinds of quadrilateral. We have square. Just the four sides, square, then rectangle, parallelogram, trapezoid, rhombus. Ang rhombus po, para siyang diamond or square na pinabingi. That is rhombus. And then, height. So, these are the quadrilateral. It has four sides. Okay, we have pentagon. It has five sides. The next one is hexagon. Six 
it has six sides. We have heptagon, seven sides. Octagon, eight sides. Nonagon, nine sides. Decagon, ten sides. And decagon, eleven sides. Dodecagon, twelve sides. Okay, so those are the types of polygons. How do we name polygon? For example, this figure is pentagon. So you just write the types of polygons, pentagon, and then the letters. Uh, clockwise. Pentagon A, B, C, D, E. That will be the name of polygon. Then, identify the vertices. We have, since pentagon yan, we have five vertices. A. A. Vertices meaning the vertex. Okay, so we have five vertex. Kaya, vertices na siya. Point A, point B, point C, point B, and point E. Okay, consecutive vertices. Kapag sinabi consecutive, magkasunod. Okay? So, A and B, B and C, C and D, D and E, E and A. Okay? Next, identify side. Side A, B, Side BC, side CD, side DE, and side EA. Okay, consecutive sides. Yung magkasunod na side. Side AB and side BC. Side BC and side DC. CD. And then side CD and side DE. Side DE and side EA. Okay, and side EA. And AB. Identify angles. So, angle A. Yung mga vertex na, gagawin nyo lang siyang angle. So, angle A, angle B, angle C, angle D, and angle E. Hmm? Consecutive angles. Angle A, and angle B. Angle B, and angle C. Angle C, and angle D. Angle D and angle E. Angle E and angle D. Tandaan nyo, kapag sinabing consecutive, that will be magkasunod. Mga ba yung diagonal? It is a segment that joins two non-consecutive vertices. Every segment that joins two vertices of a polygon must be either a side or a diagonal of the polygon. So, this is the formula. How do we get or find the number of distinct diagonals in a given polygon. For example, this one. This is the formula. D for diagonal equal to N, the number of vertex times N minus 3 over 2. N is the number of vertices of a given polynomial. For example, yung pentagon yung ginawa natin kanina. So that is 5 vertex. So, 5, you uh, substitute the value of n ng 5. And then, inahin natin yung nasa parenthesis, 5 minus 3 is 2. And then, 5 times 2 is 10. Divided by 2 is equal to 5. Meaning, uh, makakagawa tayo sa pentagon ng limang diagonal. Next, how do we find the number of diagonals in one vertex? Yung isang vertex lang ang gagamitin niya. Okay. Number of diagonals in one vertex. So, yung D is the diagonal, and then yung N yung number ng vertex, which is 5. So, D is equal to 5 minus 3, that is 2. Meaning, kada isang vertex ni pentagon, dalawang uh, diagonal ang magagawa. Okay? So, let's exercise. We have here, name of the polygon is octagon. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Kasi octagon siya, 8, uh, eight sides and 8 vertex, 8 angles. Okay, next, name the vertices. Point A, point B, point C, point D, point E, point F, point G, and point H. Name the sides. 
segment AB, segment BC, segment CD, segment DE, segment EF, or side FG, side GH, and side HH. Okay. Next, name the angles. Angle A, angle B, angle C, angle D, angle E, angle F, angle G, and angle H. We have A also angle. And then, how do we find the number of distinct diagonal? For example, octagon, we have 8 vertex. So, 8 vertices. So, yung N, papalitan natin ng 8. So, 8 minus 3 is 5. 8 times 5 is 40 divided by 2 B is 20. So, check natin kung 20 diagonals ang magagawa natin sa isang octagon. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, we have 20. Kung mapapansin nyo, bawat vertex, lima, bawat isang vertex, limang diagonal yung nagawa. Iti-check natin kung tama siya mamaya. So, ito, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Tigli lima yan. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, tigli lima bawat vertex yung nagawa uh, diagonal. So, i-check natin mamaya kung tutugma siya dun sa formula ng number of diagonals in one vertex. Ito po yun, which is octagon ang ginamit natin. So, D is equal to 8 minus 3, that is 5. So, tumama siya, tugma. So, every vertex ay makakagawa tayo ng limang diagonal. So, kung, na kung nakita nyo po kanina, binilang natin, tigli lima bawat vertex yung diagonal na nagawa. And then, all in all, we have 20 diagonal. So, we have also convex and non-convex polygon. So, ito po yung i-discuss natin. Convex and non-convex, equilateral and equiangular, and then regular and irregular polygon. So, number one is convex and non-convex. So, convex polygon, a polygon has no diagonal, can be drawn outside the polygon. So, yung diagonal niya is nasa loob lahat ng polygon. Walang nasa labas. So, that is convex polygon. For example, this one. So, kapag nilagyan natin siya ng diagonal, walang diagonal na mabubuo sa labas. Lahat ay nasa loob. Yan. So, lahat po ay nasa loob ng polygon. Kapag naman sinabing non-convex polygon, ayan naman yung polygon na may diagonal na magagawa sa labas ng polygon. For example, this one. Yan po yung may mga curve, ay yung may mga uh, hindi siya straight. Kumbaga, may parang kuweba. Okay? May cave. Kaya concave din ang tawag sa kanila. Okay, so tell me if it is convex or non-convex polygon. So this is convex polygon. Another one, this is also convex polygon. Another one is non-convex polygon kasi uh, mayroon siyang parang kuweba. So, hindi siya close talaga o yung buo. Next is convex. Next is convex. Another one is convex. This one is non-convex. This is also non-convex. And then, another one is equilateral and equiangular. So, what is the difference between equilateral and equiangular? Kapag sinabing equilateral, a polygon when all sides are congruent. So, lahat ng sides niya ay the same ang um, measurement. That is equilateral. Equilateral. Okay, line niya is or all sides are congruent. For example, this one. Itong triangle, itong square, at itong, uh, ano ba ito? He hexagon ay, they have the same measurement inside. So, all sides are congruent. So, ang tawag sa kanila ay equilateral. 
The next one is equiangular, angle, angular. So, a polygon when all angles are congruent. Yung mga angles naman niya ang pare-parehas katulad po nito. Ayan. So, pare-parehas ng sukat ng angles nila. That is equiangular. Ngayon, may tinatawag din tayong regular and irregular polygon. Pag sinabing regular polygon, a polygon that is equilateral and equiangular. Ibig sabihin, pag masasabi silang regular polygon kapag all sides are congruent and all angles are congruent. For example, this one. This is a regular polygon kasi uh, all angles are congruent and all sides are congruent. So, this is hexagon. Regular hexagon polygon po ito. Okay? Another example is this triangle. So, they have the same or equal sides. Okay? So, all sides are congruent and also the angle are congruent. So, equiangular and equilateral. So, meaning this is also a regular polygon. So, what is irregular polygon? A polygon that is equiangular but not equilateral. For example, this one. So, yung sides niya ay hindi congruent. So, pero yung angle niya ay congruent. Okay? So, equiangular siya pero hindi siya equilateral. Pero meron ding instance na uh, irregular siya. Kung iba-iba lahat, pati sides niya hindi pare-parehas, yung angles niya hindi rin pare-parehas, that is also irregular, pentag uh, irregular polygon. Katulad ng example na ito, this is regular pentagon and this is irregular pentagon. So, makikita ninyo yung difference ng dalawa, yung, side, yung angle nito ay congruent and then also the sides are congruent. But this one, this is also a pentagon but this is irregular pentagon. Why? They have uh, uh, different measurement in angles and then also the length of the sides. So, this is irregular and this is regular pentagon. Okay, so that's all. Thank you. God bless and stay safe. Until next video. Bye-bye. <clears throat>